It's case numbers like these that have Metro Detroit shoppers once again clearing out the shelves at area grocery stores. Tonight, 7 Action News reporter Simon Shaket takes a closer look at what stores are doing to stay stocked. Here at Johnny Pomodoro's Fresh Market in Farmington Hills, they say they've seen a major increase in demand from shoppers and it's part of the reason they're as focused as ever on keeping up with needs. Across Metro Detroit, an increasingly familiar scene at popular grocery stores like Kroger at Grand River and Beck in Novi and Telegraph in Long Lake in Bloomfield Township. Customers say they're once again buying up food and drinks along with paper towel and toilet paper, in some cases leaving more shelves looking empty. Today we are, we have been extremely busy. General Manager Joe Montgomery with Johnny Pomodoro's Fresh Market says they've been successful keeping up with demand thanks to making earlier orders and using various suppliers. We've been loading up and we've been persistent. You know, if something doesn't come in, we keep reordering it. Joe says compared with the scene during the last COVID-19 spike so far, customers are not being limited to how much they can buy here. That said, right now, fresh veggies fruit, meats, and cleaning items remain top sellers with uncertainty over the pandemic in the next few months. In March, we weren't ready. You know, uh, we are ready now. We are ready now. We have, uh, we've been loading up on paper towel and toilet paper for some weeks now. Tell me what you're purchasing. Today. I'm looking for the turkey giblets to make giblet gravy. So us seniors come in to get the discount. Fruit, I can only keep it a little while. It's a little too busy. I don't like it this crowded. There's also been a large rise in curbside and delivery orders with no end in sight. In part of a statement, a spokesperson for Kroger telling us, quote, there's plenty of food in the supply chain. If people just buy what they need, it'll keep working well. We are replenishing our stores daily with the supplies and products our customers need most. And with a Thanksgiving holiday coming up, they say they're also ordering extra turkeys of all sizes, big and small, to accommodate those smaller gatherings many people are now going to be having. Simon Shaykat, 7 Action News.